we define these base index forms derivative in first form x is a base n is a constant in index second case a is a base which is a constant and x is a variable at index and third case a and b both are the constant a in base and b in index now what happen when term is given x raised to x yes it is a base index form obviously it is not power function as in power function index must be constant but here index is a variable and this is not exponential function as well as base is a constant in exponential function but here base is again variable x so this is not a exponential function as well as it contain variable it does not a constant so what is derivative of this for can we take this derivative by power function or exponential function or derivative is a zero yes there is a problem and this form which contain base index having base and index both in term of variable or sometime term like this x raised to sin x or sin x raised to x maybe tan x raised to cot x observe these terms these terms are in base index form having variable x or term of x in index as well as in a base so to evaluate derivative of such a terms we use one important concept in derivative is called logarithmic differentiation as logarithmic differentiation actually logarithmic differentiation is nothing but to evaluate derivative of base index form especially base index form having both base and index contain variable x it may be variable raised to variable like this x raised to y or sometime x raised to y or sometime y raised to x these terms contain variable raised to variable or variable raised to constant or variable raised to function like x raised to sin x or x raised to log of x or x raised to tan of x or constant raised to variable like sin x raised to x or cos x raised to x or uh, say uh, cot x raised to x hmm. observe this or like this this is a form which is called function raised to function sin x raised to cos x or sec x raised to tan x or log of x raised to sin x for these terms we use differentiation called logarithmic differentiation it is a very simple method as we know different rules of logarithms we use one rule which is a log of power as m raised to n is a power term and its log is always written as n into log of m the index we take in product of log so log of m raised to n is equal to n into log of m remember this rule of logarithm using this rule we evaluate logarithmic differentiation for term which are in form of variable raised to variable now we take one example directly the example asked in exam is like this if y is equal to x raised to x 
find dy by dx then solution let y is equal to x raised to x obviously this is a explicit function as y is a dependent variable it does not carry any function and x raised to x is a term is in base index form containing both index and base as a variable x so we can't differentiate it directly as it is a base index form in variable raised to variable we take logarithmic differentiation or to do in logarithmic differentiation before differentiation use logarithm as using logs rule for base index form we can simplify the terms let do it here we take log on both side yes of course so we have to take log on both side so on left hand side I get log of y on right hand side I get log of power that is x raised to x and uh, by rule of log I can put log of y is equal to x into log of x and that's it now see this is a given expression which is in explicit term now we simplify this in implicit term as y carry also function logarithmic function now and base index the term is simplified now it is converted into simple product of terms x and log of x we have to find dy by dx for this i differentiate this with respect to x as i want to find dy by dx so it is a derivative now take a differentiation for that operate d by dx on both side the derivative of log of y with respect to x right hand side contain product so i apply product to x into derivative of second term log of x with respect to x plus log of x into derivative of first term x with respect to x now on left hand side derivative of log of y derivative of log of y is always 1 upon y but i have to find derivative with respect to x so i take rule of implicit function as this is a term of y we are differentiating it with respect to x so take a derivative of standard function log of y has a derivative 1 upon y multiplied by change in y with respect to change in x that is dy by this on right hand side x is a constant now see this is a logarithmic function again and we are going to differentiate with respect to x as this is a term of x so take its derivative only that is 1 upon x plus log of x as it is as it is out of derivative and derivative of x with respect to x is equal to 1 now we are going to find only dy by dx on left hand side i get 1 upon y into dy by dx from this i separate dy by dx so that this y is transfer on right hand side this is in denominator so we transfer it in numerator as on right hand side there is addition so i put bracket on that and multiplied or take numerator uh, y in numerator so y into bracket actually x get cancelled so first term is a 1 and second term is a log of x and finally i put value of y on right hand side which is uh, x raised to x so x raised to x into bracket 1 plus log x is our final answer okay thank you dy by dx if y is equal to sin x raised to tan of x let y is equal to sin x raised to tan of x now observe this is a base index for in which base is base is at sin x which is a function of x and in index again a function of x tan x so we have to differentiate this base index form by logarithmic differentiation for that take first log on both side or apply log on both side 
on left hand side there is a term y so we get log of y and right hand side there is a term of power so we get log of power that is log of sin x raised to tan x by rule of log we can simplify this power as take this index in multiplication of product of log so on right hand side we get tan x into log of sin of x okay this is a simplification so we differentiate this with respect to x we add we have to find here as we have to find here dy by dx now what is the derivative of log y derivative of log y is always 1 upon y into dy by dx on right hand side there is a product of two terms of x first is a tan x and second is a log of sin x so by product rule we can take derivatives for that we apply product rule first term is a tan x take it outside derivative and in derivative second term that is log of sin x with respect to x then plus sin now what is next part we take log of sin x as second term outside derivative and take derivative of first term that is tan of x with respect to x see on right hand side we apply product rule now tan of x as it is out of derivative so it remain constant and in derivative we get log of sin x now there is a uh, no product of terms of x actually this is a composite term yes in form of log of f of x okay and its derivative is equal to 1 upon f of x into derivative of f of x similarly derivative of log of sin x here f of x is a sin x so its derivative is a 1 upon sin x into derivative of sin x by chain rule plus now log of sin x in second part is a constant as it is out of derivative so it remain as it is and we have to take only derivative of tan x and derivative of tan x is always 6 square x so we get derivatives by using product rule now we have to only find derivative of this term so now tan of x is out of derivative it remain as it is 1 upon sin x it also remain constant and derivative of sin x is a cos of x plus second term is completed that is log of sin x into 6 square x now we have to find here dy by dx okay so on left hand side using differentiation we evaluated 1 upon y into dy by dx now we have to separate this dy by dx so we take this y on right hand side but in at right hand side there is an addition so we put right hand side in a bracket and take y which is at denominator on left hand side on right hand side it will be in product of product uh, in product of numerator so we can separate dy by dx it's equal to y into bracket tan x into 1 upon sin x into cos x tan x into 1 upon sin x or cos x divided by i put sin x plus second term is a log of sin x into 6 square x log of sin x into 6 square x bracket complete and finally we have to resubstitute value of y as given expression y is equal sin x 
into tan x is a explicit function always remember in explicit functions we get dy by dx in term of x only as you know f of x is a explicit function and its derivative is always f dash x it mean explicit functions derivative is always uh, if given function is in term of x then its derivative should be in term of x here given function is explicit therefore dy by dx that mean derivative of this term is should be in term of x so we put y as a sin x raised to cos x which is given okay uh, sin x raised to tan x now this bracket is simplified as tan of x into cos by sin is always cot of x and plus second term remain as it is log of sin x into sec square x and this is our final answer okay did you get this you can try another examples thank you